imagine being in the race for the first graphics card, or perhaps LiDAR detection for autonomous vehicles, or first virtual screen to see across the world, maybe even first uh, headset for virtual uh, surgeries being done remotely. Well, Triple D or Nano Dimensions are a new force to be reckoned with in the 3D printing field. They're making 3D printed electronic circuit boards, small microchips. And it's like saying finding a stock like Intel or AMD before they blew up. Nano Dimensions, you're looking at a $7 stock that has potential to hit 60 to 100 in the next three to five years. In this video, we're gonna show you an example of why potentially Nano Dimensions has a lot more growth on the way. Stay tuned, make sure you hit the red subscribe button. This is Flash Instincts. We do not provide financial advice, but everything is next level juicy content. So hit the red subscribe button and stay up to date. All right, so Nano Dimensions is a 3D printing company. We all know this. They have a lot of cash at hand. Their uh, CEO is an experienced businessman. He has made multiple companies go from a, a small company to a leading multi-million dollar company from 8 million in revenues to 300 plus. What he requires is time. Now, Nano Dimensions recently on July 1st, you could go on Yahoo Finance and see that Nano Dimension and Hensolt AG announced a joint venture for advancing prototyping and sharing 3D electronic printing design. Now, you may wonder, what is Hensolt? Who is Hensolt? Well, if you go on Hensolt's website, hensolt.net, you'll see something amazing. Right from the beginning, you'll notice that this is a German defense company. They work with the government, okay? Now, let's look beyond that. Recently, on July 1st, OCCAR awards consortium of Henselt and Theon sensors with the delivery of binocular night vision goggles for Belgian defense and the German company. So Henselt makes sensors for the German defense army. Nano Dimensions just became partners with Henselt. They are working on designs for 3D printing together for a perhaps future. On July 1st, you'll see their article posted on their website. Henselt and Nano Dimension established joint venture for 3D printing platform. And the best and the most for important thing that you see in the bottom of their website, on June 30th, Henselt wins billion dollar contract for Pegasus reconnaissance system. This is using next level technology, sensor solutions for aircraft. Now, guys, all of this technology is interrelated. There's a reason why Hensolt is partnering up with Nano Dimension. And there's a reason why Nano Dimension is slowly building on the AME field for 3D printing. They're making electronic devices that is going to change the future. They're small devices quickly made for these defense systems. Hensolt is just one primary example of the many that Nano Dimensions has yet to touch. Hensult is a German defense industry champion with a leading market position in Europe and global reach. Headquartered in Tokfirken near Munich, the company develops sensor solutions for defense and security applications. As a technology leader, Hensult is also continuously expanding its portfolio in the field of cyber and developing new products to combat a wide range of threats based on innovative approaches to data management, robotics, and cybersecurity. With more than 5,600 employees, Hensold achieved a turnover of 1.2 billion euros in 2020. Hensold is listed on the Frankfurt Stock Exchange, where it is part of the SDAX share index. So now, you take a look. <laughs> Think about it. Is NNDM partnering with this billion dollar company a big deal or not? You tell me. You see, Kathy Wood once said that, hey, yeah, shut the door and listen to this. We like to invest in companies that are working with the government and have defense mentality, like uh, Kratos defense system. A different companies that she is really investing low key that has potential to help a government or military. Because why? The military spends money. They like spending money on uh, invasions, perhaps even alien invasions, who knows? The future is full of uncertainties. The military has to be ready for advanced future technology. Technology is key, and nanodimension is part of this equation. It's a big equation, 
But Nano Dimension is fitting right in, taking its place in the history of mankind's technology, slowly but surely. Now with that being said, that's just a little bit of basics. I'm gonna put all the articles up for the sources. You guys can look it up and read it yourself. You have to read and try to understand more because this is next level connection. And it's none of these sources are foo-foo, they're not fake. So this is some legit stuff. I'm gonna go to the technical analysis real quick. This video is gonna last another two to four or five minutes. So I hope you guys like it so far. Subscribe to the channel. So Nano Dimensions, what's happening on the chart? Um, we do have a confirmed inverse head and shoulder. Um, we have this super buy zone in the red area. Um, you guys can make the chart with yourself, with me on trading view. And as it hits these super lows, if you're long on this company, you continue to add. The biggest strategy of adding is to have cash at hand. For example, you have another job where you're getting cash. And as you see huge dips, there they should be looked at as buying opportunities. Now, how would you uh, capitalize on these buying opportunities? You buy in three phases. The first time it touches this uh, buying zone, you can add 20%. If it goes another 10% below within the buying zone, you add another 20 to 30%. And if it continues to drop or slowly curves up within the buying zone, it makes another inverse head and shoulder within, buy in the right shoulder of the inverse head and shoulder and add the rest. Now you don't have to go all in, but you add whatever you feel like you want to add. The name of the game for a long-term company is to collect and accumulate the shares. Before Wall Street gets in, you want to take advantage and hold as many shares as possible. If this stock goes up to a $60 to $70 stock in the future, you're looking at a, a million dollar company in the making. You perhaps are already a millionaire and you don't even know it. That's possibly it. So we also see a classical a falling wedge. If you Google what's a falling wedge, it's a three to four month per, a down period. As the down period uh, goes down, you'll see it slowly curves up and then it breaks out. It has yet to break out really. We did break out from $5 to about $9, nine to $10. That is a pretty good breakout. And right now we're consolidating and going sideways until we go up yet again. All right, we are in the super buy zone. How did I make this super buy zone? Because we look at the peak lows before it blew up, before it went to $17. We're looking at the early ranges around the $2 range, okay? Also keep in mind, we do have $1.4 billion cash at hand. Nano Dimension is looking to acquire more companies. And our CEO, again, he's an experienced businessman. And that's something that other companies do not have. He has made multiple companies thrive from being a small company, making a few millions to hundreds of millions of dollars. I hope I was able to help. Make sure you hit the red subscribe button for more content.